Morning, ladies and gentlemen. I'm here with a Fernandez from the early 80s. This is 1984. Fernandez Limited Edition. As you can see, it looks very smart. It's a bit like a boon, isn't it? Um, this one's got all the original hardware and circuitry. Um, and the only thing that's not original on this one is the dials, which I replaced because the other ones were um, a mismatch. I don't think they were original either. Um, so anyway, I thought this looked better. Anyway, uh, let's go balanced here. Um, got both pickups turned up on the volumes here and the tone down. We'll play some finger style. All right, and then with the tone up. So that's sweet, um, and then let's do slap as well. Alright, tone up. There you go, that gives you an idea. And then uh, on the front pickup, similarly, tone down. All right, that gives you an idea, the tone up. So, uh, yeah, that's pretty nice. And then let's, let's go on the rear pickup, finally. Tone down. Oh yeah, that's nice. Very nice, yeah. So that's rear pickup with the tone right down and then with it up. So you get the idea, you know, that's it. <laughs> The Fernandez Limited Edition from 1984. So uh, construction-wise, you've got an ash body, um, and this one is, it's not too heavy. Um, you know, a lot of these old bases, sometimes you, you think, 
God, they're, they're heavy. But uh, this one, no, no, it's about 4.1, 4.2 kilograms. It's fairly lightweight. Um, and, uh, you know, I love the matching color. This, uh, this vintage white is beautiful. Um, it's very smart looking base. Like I said, it looks a bit like a moon. Sets up pretty nice. Uh, at the moment, it's at 1.5 millimeters. Um, might go a bit lower than that with some adjustment on the truss. Um, it's a neck off type adjustment uh, on this, like the old Moon R2. Um, and I, s I expect with a little bit more um, perseverance, I could get the setup really good on this. <coughs> they often do set up really well. Um, and that's it, really. Uh, it's it's a nice base. Very good. Very good indeed. Um, nice rosewood fretboard, mid size frets. Um, got the uh, vintage style tun tuners there um, and with these ones they these are interesting because underneath here they've hollowed out two holes in the headstock to make the headstock a bit lighter I think um, and also to accommodate uh, the uh, the uh, there's some strapping on the back of the uh, on, on the back of the tuning pegs there uh, that holds the uh, the uh, the uh, key and and winder in place. Um, of course, it's it's all made of metal, but uh, yeah, it's great. It's a good base. Thanks for watching.